back to Miller. He's such a beautiful user of the ball. Down towards Mac Andrew, the rising star nominee this week. O'Brien. Dawson gets it away by hand. And as far as Rao. Rao was taken down. Caught from behind. Beautifully tackled, though. Murphy from directly in front. Home crowd likes it. We see a lot of numbers around the ball. Alice is probably the spare for the Suns. Walker uses his strength, finds a bit of space, grabs it out of the ruck. Bouncing ball by oh. Tex. Oh, what a goal that is! Can do no wrong at the moment, the big Texan. And the Crows have got two on the board. Ruck round indeed. Well, in the end, it is by Hinge. It's an aggressive ball in the middle of the ground. Didn't really want to take advantage. Schomburg now picks it up, drives the ball forward. Tex has got a little bit of space. Trouble for Collins. We know he's a long kick of the footy. Out of the right, piercing ball. Rotated in the tackle. Across to Crouch now. Dawson with a long left foot kick. It's absolutely perfect. I saw the half forwards oh. running through the middle of the ground. Phil Falk tries to put it in that direction. Oh. It's a well weighted kick. And then going inside their own Ford 50. Be a little bit less predictable. Holman left the footy behind. Wobbling ball inside. She's got good hands. Kick the last goal, the first term, Fogarty for his second for the afternoon. He's a wonderful finisher in front of the sticks, and it's a perfect start for the Crows. <laughs> that was to help the Crows then, I think, wasn't it? Casbolt grabs it out of the ruck, dishes it out to Humphrey, the elusive one. Goes back to Ellis, snapping ball. Can this be the first? Touch right on the line by Keane. We'll have a listen. Power ran out of room. The wobbling ball cut off by Schoenberg does nicely. Traps it one hand, drives it forward. And here's Saligo. Can he draw this one back? Saligo. Look at the crowd in the background. He does just that. Perfect finish, Saligo. Roses immediately accelerates away. And he has got some toe as well. Thinks about a second bounce in the end. Pass it on to Ainsworth by hand. That's better transition by the Crows. Here's the important moment. King goes one-on-one -on -one with King. It's still getting pushed forward. O'Brien. I think King might have got a boot on it. Now Powell. Sends it to the defensive flank. That's a nice little grab by Smith. Got a Two goals apiece for the term after the Crows led by 29 at the first break. Keys make that three goals to two for the term. Into a dangerous area. Get the bounce there after Ballard. Spirals it out of defence. Beautifully taken by the impressive four lays on Deburu. Murphy clears. Good ball, a one-hander. Kuda threw it up to the crowd as well. And straight past his man, a little outside of the foot kick. This is a better build-up. Here's the important kick, and it's good. Yeah, they got it right that time. Tex was there, as with Andrew with the fist. Jones got one a touch yeah, high. And that was a clear high one. I think he raised his arm at all in that, in that contest. Tex is not happy Tex about it. He comes in to remonstrate with Swallow. You're playing a little bit of your own game as well. Holding. Okay. And the way we're out. On the angle. Hits it nicely. That's the start the Gold Coast Suns wanted. Ainsworth didn't take possession. Comes up at ground level though. Scoops it out. Now Humphrey just wobbles the ball forward. It hangs and hangs and hangs. Lukosius keeps his feet. Hinge takes on one tackle. Didn't get rid of it. McPherson, here's an important kick from 45. McPherson, here come the Gold Coast Suns. Humphrey starting to ask questions. The Adelaide Crows, exciting young player. Drives it deep forward. Lukosius is in the area as is King, but it's Lukosius standing in front. That's the picture ahead of him. Lukosius to a round of boos. And he silences the boos, runs into his opponent. Four in a row. Okay. Don't give it away. Don't give it away. Well, they're well and truly up and about Gold Coast, aren't they? So Gold Coast have done well, though. They've been forcing Adelaide to bomb the ball into their Ford 50. Hinge taken down after he got rid of it. He's got to be and careful. It's really here. on now. Yeah. King comes in. Roses is there. There wasn't a lot in. I think Hingy put a little bit of mayo on it just to make sure the free went. 
Plays on then, just hoofs it deep forward. And out the back of ball ace. Smith to release the pressure a touch. Powell in the front of the pack. Walker read it nicely. He has had issues with legs before. Yeah. So it's in the contest. Rear four eight forward. Saligo keeps it in. Winds it back to a dangerous area. Fisted away again by Collins. Here comes Tex. Here comes Tex. There goes Tex. Wits, nice tap to swallow. Just gets a boot on it. Wobbles it forward. King doesn't get the bounce he's after. Coming in his cheaters. King should finish. And does finish. Immediate answer for the Gold Coast Suns. Straight through Miller, who dropped it at first slip. And now Crouch tries to pinpoint and does well. Rochelle on a pretty quiet afternoon. But that's a good ball to Saligo. He plays on, wants to go. They're out everywhere now. McAdam will stroll in. McAdam, much needed for the Crows. He got it right, Howie. He probably should have stayed on, his, on the same line and, and maybe accessed his right foot. Oh, been, uh, it's a turnover ball. It looked like a risky kick off the boot. Dawson just slid in and swooped on it. Fourth most games of anyone to really hurt the Gold Coast Suns. And he does it and enjoys it. Tackle oh. comes in and just kicked the opposition. If he tackles still, thought, Lee, that's holding the ball. Yeah. Rochelle sticks to the boundary line. Oh, McAdam can produce a highlight and does. Have a look at this. I did that on ruck round, no, can you, Harry? Not it's over the ruck, no. man. It's tough. It's tough at senior level from a fitness perspective. Sloan with a clearance to his great mate, Tex. Be careful. He wants to get off. He'll load up here, Walker. Doesn't yeah. time the ball. Heard a whistle. Doesn't matter. McAdam's got it anyway. You're right, Harry. It's a mark anyway, but just late hit on Taylor Walker. And he does just that. Roses, loops it forward, Ellis, read the other way though by Big Mark Keane. That little Gaelic style kick around the corner is beautiful. Rochelle has got Fogarty and he'll stop and prop and he'll go back and finish the whole thing. Good percentage too. Yeah. They'll be keeping an eye on Geelong and Port Adelaide at GMHBA tonight then. Siren, the Crows would challenge but they hold on and hold off the Crows. Get the job done over the Suns, a 10th win of the season for Adelaide and they keep their finals hopes alive.